Hey Shaka Plum, this is Eve of Grow Together with Eve, where we gather to help you grow and plan better outcomes by sharing lifestyle, planning tips, and resources. In this video, we're going to flip through my big happy planner. I use this for faith, and I started off with the teacher's edition, as you'll see here, and used dotted field paper towards the end of the year. So here in October was like a test page before I jumped into... Um, January of 2021. On that currently page, I really just kind of used it. Uh, let me get it <laughs> in better view. I used it for, um, you know, what my priorities were, goals, and friends and family's birthdays. Along the left-hand side of each column, you'll see that I've titled things out um, mainly started with fruits of the spirit in the application of the scriptures. And um, I use the scripture of the day by you version uh, really throughout the whole year. I uh, also put my prayers and blessings or gratitude in different categories as well. Um, so... <laughs> Thanks for checking out this video. If you are new to the channel, um, I definitely want to invite you to hit the subscription button and the bell for notifications. Um, I am going to do more planner videos this year than I did last year. If you are new, I have a wonderful family with four children and have just now really found my bearings with being a mother of four. The youngest is now um, in January will be two. So if you're a mom, give me a little whoop whoop down in the comments so I know what other moms are here, if you can feel me. Did you just notice that those last two months had nothing in it? It happens like that sometimes. We do our best. Um... So sometimes I would get to um, having my quiet time and writing out things, and sometimes I didn't. This year, I really tried to give myself a lot of grace as um, for me, just checking in with the app was a, a big thing. So some days I would just read my scripture and not take out the planner and write things down. Now, if you're watching this and you love the floral stickers that I used in most of those spreads and actually the spreads that are coming up, um, these are where I kept my sermon notes. FYI, I did take a class called um, Kingdom Ethics and Sexuality this, this past year, and that was great. So that was some of the printed out notes there. And for the second half of the year, I moved into this big. So my sister-in-law had given me kind of like the covers and the disc to her teacher planner that she used. She uses hers for real estate. Um, and so I had dot grid filler paper and I thought, hey, this would be a good way to faux bullet journal. Um, and if I want to change out the layout, I can. But this really showed me that I really kind of like to do a horizontal layout. I enjoyed using these stickers. Um, here are some um, Spoonful of Faith was on that page. I put a little Wrong Wrong mixed in with the Live Love Posh stickers. So it's a mixture of, it's mainly Live Love Posh, but a touch of other things with it. And this is November. Wow. It's so funny how flipping through the year looks so short. <laughs> so tell me down in the comments below too, if you um, use a faith journal um, or if you have like a, a prayer strategy binder, what do you use? How do you lay it out? Do you decorate it? I would love to know in the comments down below. So this is December and um, these were the two sticker books that came out for December as well. And that is it. I kind of rounded it, rounded this up at the, the middle of December and this half 
is mainly social media that I tried to plan here, but then found out that that really wasn't a good setup for me um, to have social media and faith together. But I thought I would share it because I love the dashboard setup. And this very last spread with the grow stickers are spoon full of faith. Thanks so much for flipping through this planner with me. If you want to check out my 2022 lineup, I invite you to. There's a link in the description box. And if you're not subscribed, I want to invite you to do that too. Until next time, much love, joy, truth, and growth to you. Bye now.